All right, guys, so the bumper came. I don't know if you guys can see it right down there. Oh my goodness, it actually came. It said in the shipping description, it's gonna take about, you know, a couple months. Um, so, because it came from Taiwan. Yeah, Taiwan. It came within a week, so. I'm gonna put that cell in the description. Honest, if you guys want an M3 bumper ASAP, this guy did it perfectly. Um, the grills hasn't came yet, but I, I'm not gonna put on the grills or anything like that. I'm not gonna rush it. I'm gonna put on the bumper for y'all. All right, guys, so right now I'm gonna be taking off these uh, little sponges, whatever the heck these are, I don't know, like water trim, I guess, weather stripping. Yeah, weather stripping, that was the word I'm looking for. It's gonna be all around the car. Take all that off, and that just comes off like that. I'm sure you guys that'll put it back on if you don't know how, but it's pretty self-explanatory. Take that off. Take all that off. Basically, it's one in the other, and then you just put it right back on. It's that easy. That's that. And then we got a couple of screws up here. One, two, three, four. Alright guys, so we're using a 5x16 hex screw. It's not a hex screw, it's like the uh, the female head screw. And yep, it looks like it's right size. So we're gonna take out all, I think there's like, how many? One, two, three, there's four, seven. seven of them? Yeah. There's seven screws here. So we're gonna take out all seven of them. All right guys, so there's a screw right there, one right here, and there's like two right there. So I'm assuming that I have to take off these two to move down this flap to take out those two. So I'll let you guys know what I do in a second. Alright guys, so I just put back this wheel. Um, see if I can focus in over here. So I, I basically took all this off the side wheel well, whatever thingy move offer. To get to these top screws, do that. This should just like come off. Last two screws on that side. Uh, don't mind the noise in the back. It's just my dad, you know. <laughs> all right, so. Uh, we're unscrewing all the screws. This should just pop out. Hopefully, we can just pop the bumper. Obviously, there's some fog lights. We have to disconnect some wires. But other than that, you know, it should just come off. And then um, I'm not gonna putting it. I'm not gonna be putting any of the grills on these because I ordered some new ones. But yeah, we'll see how it looks. I got mine's up. How many screws on here? Two, right? Yeah. It's just like this right now, right? Ooh, my lord! It's coming off. Oh, there's some wires. Holy cow! All right, guys. So I just told him my car. <laughs> oh my, it still looks mean. It's good, it's, uh, we just test fit it. Um, the bottom screws don't line up, but I guess just because it's a different size, we'll try to you know reorient it and see how it looks. But overall, it fit, the fitment around the lights are good, everything's good. So we're gonna put the thing back together and um, put it on the car.
Alright guys, so that's how you put on the bumper. We just basically put in a few screws. Then we put on the two that are on the sides that how we remove the bumper. We showed you guys in the beginning how to remove it. There's two screws there. And we just put two on the bottom. One right there and one right there. Other than these two screws, you should be uh, good. Um, so far the car looks amazing. I can't wait to wrap this last fender and then you should I'll be done by then All right guys if you enjoyed the video, please smash that like button if we can smash another hundred likes that would be amazing um, Everyone's opening up the garages right now. My dad just got home. So yeah guys appreciate all the support if you love how it looks I think it looks crazy. Look at it looks like some devil eyes in the background. I don't know angel eyes here um, If you guys did enjoy take it easy, and I'll see you in the next one